yeah, so why is the Isle of Man a mecca for motorsport fans? Um, I think it's got everything really. Obviously the closed road element is very unique to the Isle of Man. We've got probably the most interesting, exciting and dangerous track in the world with the TT course as well. And from my background originally it was rally and uh, to date still now I think it's one of the best tarmac rallies in the world because of the roads and the nature of the roads. It's hilly, um, it's undulating, it's kind of bumpy and it's uh, proper demanding. I think the thing with the TT course that makes it so special, first of all, is its length. It's 37 and three quarter miles long. You've got to memorise it. And when you're doing 200 miles an hour, many corners look the same. And also bumps which look nothing at 30, 40 miles an hour are a big problem at uh, 200 miles an hour. But uh, the course is amazing. It's, it's almost gladiatorial. We all know the Isle of the TT course, but there's a lot of roads inside and outside of the course as well. From my rallying background, I would say uh, they're some of the most challenging and demanding roads in the world and for me some of the best um, and you've got the bumps, you've got the narrowness, you've got the speed and definitely here if a car works on the Isle of Man it pretty well works anywhere. The, the 718 as a chassis and a driving car is fantastic, um, they always have been. The beauty of it is it's the, the centre of gravity and how low it is and how it makes the car feel so planted. Most of sport is a massive thing on the Isle of Man. Um, you know, here we are in Conor Cummings Cafe, um, famous TT rider, a legend on the island, and uh, but normal guys. You know, um, I started here with karting. My grandmother and my grandfather rallied. My mum and dad did, and actually my first co-driver was my mother. So there was always something going on with motorsport. I suppose we can't run away from it. It's here, so we all have to be involved, and uh, we all become very much a part of it. I was born and bred on the Isle of Man. This is my home and um, I love coming back here. It's uh, still quite an amazing place and uh, when the sun's shining, there's nothing quite like it.